Welcome bird done found him a worm. Mmm, dessert. Mmm, that looks good. To a bird. Might like sucking down a strand of spaghetti. I thought I'd take a closer look and show you what that mockingbird was eating a while ago. What we're looking at is we're under a persimmon tree. And there's persimmons here on the ground and he was chewing up one of the persimmons. Turned out it wasn't a worm at all. I'll show you what one looks like hanging on the tree. There's a persimmon growing on the tree. It's a fruit, a wild fruit. Pluck one, get a better look at it. There's the fruit right there, about the size of a small cherry tomato. Only believe me, it's not no tomato. They say these things are sour, turn your mouth inside out. Bust one open here. It's got a fruit, syrupy feel to it. What the heck, I'll taste it. Not a bad taste at all. I guess because it's ripe, those sour ones must be the ones that ain't ripe yet. I didn't eat it, but I tasted it. Now I got persimmon juice all over my hands. I can't touch my camera or my, or my remote control. Persimmon trees are growing wild up and down my fence line over here. Let's see if I can do it with the button on top of the camera. I'm not sure I was holding that persimmon very steady. I laid one here on the deck and we'll zoom in on it. Looking at a ripe persimmon. It was kind of orange, but it's turning off a dark color as it ripens. I'll have to look and see if there's any recipes or anything for them. I might be game enough to try some of them. They're definitely, the tree out there is definitely covered with ripe persimmons. Anyway, that's what a persimmon looks like. 